Hi oh, yeah, guys, I just thought I'd give a quick update on the uh, one of my games rooms. Uh, these machines, I can't really do much with them anymore because I've done what I can with them. So I'll just quickly show what I've done. Uh, you probably know this one by now. I have still have this one at £15. This is the extra nudge one, red bar. I've put my big seven, £4, the original one next to it. It's still 10p. I've managed to fix it now reached 10p's. Before the other board, it took 10 pieces. We never read them, and these two are chuzzies. Uh, there's my red bar, eight pound jackpot. Flashing with buttons there, and my bar X. I'm still trying to get a ROM for that original ROM. I'm working on it, but at the moment it's still chuzzy. I've had it originally it was a map, but I took it out. So yeah, these are all sort of complete. I'll have a quick play of them in a minute. Let's put my light on so you can see. And these are all my spares. Right, what I'm doing with these, all these boards, I've got loads in here. I've managed to get somebody that's going to have a look at them now. There's about 10 in there. I've got one here. He's going to send them to his arcade, Mafia at One Tech, and uh, hopefully he's going to send them to Electric Coin for him to recon. I mean, the Electric Coin won't give you the time of day because I'm not an arcade, so I'll just go through. Mafia at one tech and new batteries and everything so I'll, have a few, I'll say keep a few for himself if he can and I'll just keep a few spare because I need three boards one for me casino big seven at my dad's I need one for the big seven in the garage and I will eventually need one for the big seven behind me because I think that battery is on its way out it's still playable but sometimes you'll keep its memory there's my red bar reels I see all the real bands are here spare buttons which is always worth having and I managed to get these cheap off eBay got quite a lot of them it's the LEDs now some of them fit casino cabs and some do fit this uh, wooden ones in here so it's always worth it's always nice to have spares um, I've got all the spare parts elsewhere just lent them out for now because it's no good to me so I've got loads of decals in there Barrett's real bands, yellowy red bar real bands. Uh, Chuzzy chip there that work wait no it don't work. You, you plug it in a green light comes on and know what happens. I think it's that chip there. And you've got loads of uh, security chips. That's for that's actually out of that one. Because I've chosen it at the moment, but I will put it back to now one day. So you know there for uh, a chew. No, they're just mainly manuals, yeah, stick settings, blah blah blah, and tools. I don't know what that's off. I think it's off of one of the old machines, back door, but I don't know. I think it's on all the bin because it might come in handy. You never know. But yeah, so I've got plenty of spares. It's always nice to have more, but yeah, I can't wait to get them done. So I can get new boards and all the machines. Eventually, I want to get more. Get rid of that monopoly in my garage, hot property, because I've got it on M is it MF well, we call it now on my computer anyway, I've got about a thousand games on my laptop. Is it MFME? That's it. So I'll see if anybody wants that hot property. And I can replace it with one of these, which are not on my MFE yet. So let's go quick go on this. This is 25p a go. Extra nudge if it does. This one I got from a closed down arcade in Blackburn. More about nearly two and a half years, three years ago now. When I first got this one, it won't boot up properly. Kept going off the alarm, kept going off saying C1. It's coin error somewhere. Yellows are a bit battered and <laughs> the reels are a bit battered and bruised. So yeah, now this is it. Can't do anything else with this one now. Okay, we're extra nuts for the jackpot. No. How old are you that?
Okay. Okay, let's go on this one. Ten p play, four pound jackpot. Uh, this is the uh, we've got the uh, sequence. If it's in the mood, one of the videos you do see it. Fifty p. I can remember as a kid when these first come out in the arcades. Well, just had every loads of these. If you saw a big seven, you'd bound to see a Barrex back in the day. Massive jackpot of four pound tokens at the time. Well, so far, I'm not in a very good mood, are they? I've got my eye on a bar X7 at a mate of mine in Hull, so um, if I can get rid of that property very soon, I'll pull it there for now. And I've got Magic 7 as well, so at least what I can do with one of them, I'll choose the, the um, Magic 7 or the Barrack 7. But they'll be staying downstairs because them casino covers are very heavy. There's no way you get them upstairs. These aren't too bad because these are just, obviously just plywood, aren't they? So, still heavy, but not as much. Okay, cherries out of that. Let's try the chuzzies. What I've had to do on this one is um, put these reels in because when you put the chuzzy, well, you can't see it now, but they're the original ones out the uh, normal play. But the reels don't line up the same, they're all like high up or too low all over the place. I mean, they're still not really level, but it's better than it was. So I'm going to call these a chuzzy reels, and then when if I do put this back to normal play, I'll just bang them reels over there back in. It's only a two minute job. That's why it's always nice to have spares. This one's 20p ago, £8 jackpot. It's about 88%. So I'll put it on high. I've had a couple of woos out of it yesterday, so while I get it in this video. Again, I got this one from the same arcade in Blackburn, but a few months before. I just said to the bloke who owned it, I said, have you got the other one still? And he went, yes. Yeah. So I thought, why not have them both? I don't know where the big that one come from. I just got it from a um, lock-up in Colm, which isn't far from Accrington. And I got that one from a private house in uh, Leicester. Uh, back in 2015, you've probably seen the first video I ever did on these fruit machines on when I was half pissed. That's when it was concept. I've got the concept kit for it somewhere, but I just don't really bother with them. I think the only time I'll concept these again, if I get a, a flutter box, at least I'll have a top board, so a bit more fun. To be honest with you, I don't think I'll get much out of this today. But you just never know with these chuzzies. I need 
nick that sign off my uh, nephew's grabber in the garage. Right. <coughs> Two quid there. No. Okay, let's see if it flashes for the red bar. No. Okay. I'm getting people asking me on YouTube now where, where we're getting these machines from because after them they're still quid. They're after them themselves. Just look around. You all you will find you will find sites or people that are flogging them. There's a couple of um, sites on uh, Facebook I do use. It's uh, Fruit Machine Swaps and Sales, I believe it's called. And the other one's uh, Coin Operated Appreciation. Uh, society or something like that um, where they do you can show your videos um, sell your bandits it's not just fruit machines it's video games grabbers pushers so it's worth having a look on Facebook I'll just look on eBay Nah, I'm not getting much out of this. So, quid. Okay. Okay, well, I'll hold it again for two quid, even though I put quite a bit in it. today let's try bar X my first one to buy for the family they lease get me teeth in the first one I bought for the family these electric coins I've got For one minute, that's a good job. The bars in still a pain in the ass taking these coins. Chuzzy on this one, you can have it from 5p to 50p. I believe, yeah, it's 50p, is it? Yeah, 50p. Just confusing myself. Jackpot varies from £2 to uh, £75. You've probably seen one of the other videos when I uh, trialed it on my um, Magic 7 and I actually get the jackpot out of it. Right, I'm going to ignore the £2. There you go, that's why. Oh, he's got a jackpot on this video. Okay. Last 
spare pennies anywhere. A few in my pocket. I'm on the shocker. Was that eight quid a one off? Oh, Barra. Nah, I didn't hold that time. Oh, I quit. Another one. Okay. Super duper eight pound jackpot. And I wasn't expecting that. Got it third old? No. Nope. Put eight pounds flashing away again to say that someone's had the jackpot out of it. So, uh, yeah, if you see it flashing in an arcade, it doesn't mean it's not going to pay out again. It could be in the middle of a sequence, you just never know. That's probably the reason why he's done it. But it only does it on the bar X, don't do it on any of the uh, big sevens red bars or anything. Right, nearly at the end of my 20 minute vid. So another pound or two. Two quid. Jackpot definitely isn't there, so I'm not going to bother with it. Well, there you go. That's four of them. Let's say there's nothing else I can do with these now. They're all 100%. It's just case of messing around with the ROMs and putting them back to normal or whatever but yeah they're all tightened up new reels in all of them and uh, yeah anyway thanks for watching I'll do some more videos soon uh, thank you for watching